Hello gamers, how you doing? Welcome back, welcome back to another stream. How's it going? <laughs> the favorite bimbo, yes. Hello Cablo, how you doing? And welcome Pablo as well. And Rabbit Ears, hello, welcome, welcome to the chat. <laughs> So, we said on last stream that we were gonna try Sam and Max, so we're gonna be doing that today. And we'll see how that goes. Just let me, just let me get the game going. <laughs> just a second, Twitch is dying on me. Oh no. Oh no. Alright, I'll give it a second. I mean, the game is still, like, loading, so it's fine. <laughs> All right, there we go. I really never played like, I mean, I, I guess I have played some, but I haven't really played a bunch of point and click adventure games, which I, which is, as far as I understand, that's what Sam and Max is. <laughs> The model, yeah, the new model. Thank you. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. <laughs> I am very happy with how it turned out. Very, very happy. And it's got like the different the different emotions. So it can be I can be scared. And I can and I can be flushed, you know, and stuff. <laughs> it's nice. It's nice. I love I like it. Alrighty, well, I guess we'll just get get on with the game what's this episode one there's different episodes okay so i guess might as well just start with episode one cool absolutely love the new model <laughs> thank you Ooh, that was oh my god my model is struggling I really hope it's not gonna keep struggling throughout the entire game and it's just the one cutscene. <laughs> it's like lagging, it's like lagging behind, what the hell? <laughs> Alright, the intro goes pretty hard, not gonna lie. The booba is taking all the dedicated RAM. <laughs> of course, of course it's the booba. Quit moving around so much, bobblehead. When are we gonna get another case, Sam? Surely the local lawbreakers must miss our esoteric brand of personalized criminal justice. Patience is a sharp razor to swallow, little buddy. Okay, don't scream this time. <gasps> ah! I got it! I got it! Hello? Leave Swiss cheese by the rat hole, or you'll never see your precious phone alive again. Jimmy what? Christmas Eve in a padlock sweat box. Some misguidedly ballsy felons napped our phone. Eerie. I just went cheese shopping. How did they know? <laughs> be sure it's Swiss cheese, right? And be quick about it. Oh my god. Ordinarily, I hate yielding to extortion, but I have to admit I'm half charmed by the sheer spunk of that oily little perp. Where'd you put the cheese, Max? Gosh, it was hours ago. You know I have the memory of a dried trout. Sadly, yes, I do. <laughs> well, it's got to be somewhere in this room. All right, hopefully... Oh, my God, like, we're still struggling. Like, my my model is just, like, fucking struggling to keep up with the game for some reason. I don't know why. It's like... the, the Playing the game is, like, lagging it. That is weird. Why is that happening? Is it something to do with like fucking graphic settings? I really didn't expect to have fucking graphical problems running a game that looks like this, to be completely honest. Oof. 
Why do we go like all the way to low? There's only low and high graphic settings. Oh my god, there's no like in between. Amazing. Wow. Holy shit, this is like struggling. Oof. Oh my god. Like I'm, I'm, I I should have tested this. Holy shit, I should have tested this beforehand. I am so sorry. <laughs> I did not know that this... How how was I supposed to know that this game was going to take, like, so much fucking, like... Like, res so many fucking resources to run. Like, holy shit. Is that better? I think it's better. Alright, yeah, yeah, it seems to be... It seems to be better. Let me just, like, rearrange my windows now. All right, sorry about that. Sorry about that. That was a bit unexpected. Foxy, how you doing? Welcome. Welcome. I'm gonna put Jeff Bezos' wallet in a blender. He seriously lied my end of the stream just to give me a nap. <laughs> oh no. Oh rip, that fucking sucks. We're gonna blame you for not thinking ahead, Mimbo privilege. <laughs> God damn it. Good, how you doing, babe? I'm doing quite all right. What the fuck happened? What was that? <laughs> what was that? I'm doing quite all right. Can't watch. I have to hunt down Bill Gates. I am so sorry. No comment. Oh, I clicked on the on the desk. It's very adorable. Max is super cute. Whee! <laughs> Twenty years worth of electric bills take up a surprising amount of space. Oh my god! Twenty years. Lost the door. Also, chat didn't talk. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Fuck. Did I miss that again? I absolutely missed that again, didn't I? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed about it. I'm sorry. I'm getting it fixed. I'm getting it fixed. It. What did Pablo send this time around? Professional streamer, everybody. And there Life we go. Troubling your digestion. <laughs> Sorry. Reality blocking your passages. <laughs> Expel your troubles with Emetics, the handbook for multicolored happiness, and separate your bliss. What the actual? Hey, fuck? that's that personal color spectrum book. Self help for the helplessly selfish. Perfect. <laughs> I'll take two. Amazing. Hmm. Dartboard, time machine. What the fuck evening, is it? Coco. Sorry, I'm late. Just got home from work. Oh no worries, like all the, we're we're just getting started, really. Professional stream wrong. <laughs> Professional bimbo. No thoughts. Boobs only. No thoughts. Yoo hoo! Tiny hoodlums. Leave the cheese by the hole. Uh -huh. Oh, there, oh, there's the there cheese, of course. <laughs> Unfortunately, this is not Swiss cheese. So what? So, the rat was very specific about wanting Swiss cheese in particular. <laughs> we do not negotiate with terrorists. Good old Lou. Who's Lou again? The bowling ball, of course. Why does, why does the bowling ball have a name? Donut box. Last month's donuts. Don't throw that out! I'm saving it for a science experiment! You bet, little buddy. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like this a little kid, I love handy. it. <laughs> Don't do that again. By the way, is the game too loud? Just just checking. Yep. I think Hubert could use some water, Max. I'm training him to fetch it himself! On Discord? I did. I did see some, some of it. I'm, I'm still like... A bit like... Very disappointed. A bit, a bit disappointed with Dragon's Dog, but not gonna lie. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Spatula. How's the weather in there? Where's the rest of the news collection, Max? It's a surprise! Oh, no. The science project that sounds perfect. Well, thank you. Thank you. Good to know. Do you not name bowling balls? Coco Mine's name is Frank. I do not have a bowling ball. I guess I never thought about naming one. Also, 
Sheriff, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that you're like <laughs> not being able to load the stream. <laughs> Damn. Guess I can watch a stream halfway tonight because Bases decided screwing me is too much fun. Sorry to cut out, but I don't have the patience for this BS. Yeah, no, no, no worries. I don't, I don't blame you. Really better not leave until we've taken care of this Swiss cheese ransom the phone deal. All right, so we have to actually deal with it with whatever is here. Ah, uh, yes, I remember that case. Particularly gruesome. I officially have beaten the final boss of the post-game DLC before touching most of the main story despite <laughs> being on my first playthrough. <laughs> nice. Finally playing good games. <laughs> yeah. I, I've been convinced to give Sam and Max a shot. I do gotta admit, it's, it's like, I know the characters and they're very cute, but like, I've never played the games. Because I, I just haven't really played like point and click adventures. Right here for calendars. I'm glad we stocked up. We've been going through them at a rate of about one a year since then. <laughs> I love them. <laughs> I love them. <laughs> the humor is so fucking dry. I love it. When I got this thing, I thought it would be useful. Where else would we keep the pieces of paper that we're never going to look at again? <laughs> what the fuck do I do though? They have. A gun, a bowling ball, and a boxing glove. Can I just like blow holes on the cheese and pretend that it's Swiss cheese? Take that, you law breaking dairy products. Sam, no! The cheese was innocent! <laughs> innocent? I think not. <laughs> Now it's Swiss Voila. cheese. Swiss cheese. There it is. Well, I am so smart. Casual observer, anyway. Don't I am so Voila. fucking smart. Greet. I'm telling you this, Coco. The, the dumbest idea is usually correct. <laughs> would like to thank you for your offer. The members of Sam and Max would like their phone back now. It wasn't a dumb idea. It was a very, very smart I idea. I regret to inform you the situation has changed, and I am unable to comply with your request. A list of additional demands for the return of the phone is as follows. <laughs> Piece of shit. <laughs> now, let's discuss this calmly. Let's debone <laughs> the smarmy little skis and see if the phone's in there. I ain't talking, coppers. Jimmy Tutti ain't no rat. <laughs> Uh, well, I ain't talking. <laughs> I love it. Um, yeah, let's, play, let's play the good cop, bad cop. Look, I want to help you, <laughs> but my partner is a little unhinged. I'm afraid I may be unable to keep him from harming you in some colorfully gruesome fashion. <laughs> Let me at him, Sam! Eh, I can take care of myself. Ah, oh, rip. Hmm. We've met your demands, we got you the cheese. Any honorable rodent would hold up his end of the bargain and give back our phone. Us rodents is not known for being particularly honorable. God damn it. <laughs> help me help you, Jimmy. What the heck is that supposed to mean? <laughs> I have no Excellent. idea, but it always sounds good on TV. <laughs> oh my god. We'll go half easy on you if you'll just cough up the phone. Yeah, yeah. Never happened, pig. So what the fuck do I do? <laughs> what what does, what happens if I click here? Oh, I can switch characters. Oh. I'm thinking about stuffing a light bulb down your throat, perp. Go ahead. I've been a little hungry. Hey, dog face, your partner's giving me a headache. <laughs> What the fuck do I do? I don't... Uh... You mentioned a headache. Would you like some aspirin? Oh, and while I'm at it, is there anything else I can do to make you comfortable? Are you thirsty, perhaps? Light's too bright? Well, that's sporting of you. Now you mention it, <laughs> I really don't like being up here so high. I got me a thing about heights. They make me nervous, you know? Oh, really? <laughs> I gotta try switching to watching to my computer to see if I can actually watch instead of using audio only mode. Alright, alright, no worries. 
Oh, you were telling me to click the badge to switch characters. I'm sorry, I didn't read that. <laughs> Let Max do the job, yes. Don't like heights, eh? How'd you like it if I dangled your greasy hide out the window? Hey, you wouldn't. Wait! I warn you, <laughs> I'm known for my fuzzy white butterfingers. It's true. You should see him trying to tie an ascot. All right, all right! Have mercy! I've had mercy. It was unpleasantly gooey, like, well, like things that have fallen onto pavement from a great height. I give up! Take your phone and let me go! <laughs> ah, for the love He actually ate the ball. What I the fuck? I see that. <laughs> oh my god. Hello. Yes? Great gouts of steaming Not magma on a beeline for the orphanage. We're on our way. <laughs> Where's the rat? I let him go. Who was on the phone? It was a commissioner, Max. <laughs> Multiple reports of malfeasance in the neighborhood. Oh, joy! That's my second favorite feasance. Idiot. We've got to get down to the corner <laughs> store right away. My god. <laughs> that was really funny, not gonna lie. Oh my god, the fucking performance of this game. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Hold down shift to run, double click to run. What? Oh, okay, I see now. Who this? Say there, unfashionably dressed street urchin. Oh, you made me mess up. Now I have to start all over. <laughs> Yowzers, you are one ugly kid. Hey, I know you. Oh, that's right. You're one of the lovable scamps from that old TV show about the singing soda jerks. It's called the Soda Poppers. And the 70s are not old. <laughs> Specs, it's you! Wow, an actual celebrity vandalizing our neighborhood. This is great! <laughs> Tell me something about that trendy modern street art you're perpetrating. What about it? Hmm... How did you select your subject matter? He looks like a fried egg! It's Brady Culture! He's the genius behind the Ibo Ocular Fitness Program. You really should try one of his videos. I'd rather try a fried egg! Same. <laughs> Ibo. Ibo sounds like an electronic archery toy. Ibo is the truly visionary Ocular Fitness Program. Ocular try Fitness? The video today. <laughs> oh my god. Sounds fascinating. But we enough about that. TTS, so you can never get enough of Brady Culture's eyeballs. <laughs> Actually real. Hmm. Is this art or is it advertising? I, I, I'm not. Is there really any difference? Good point, little buddy. <laughs> <laughs> well. Well, we'll leave you to it. But you yeah. have to agree to paint me next! Sorry, I only paint Brady culture. Max, you've got the TV schedule memorized. Weren't the soda poppers going to be featured on one of those grim celebrity tell-alls today? <laughs> yeah. On channel 173, the Child Star Exposé Network, which we only get when it's convenient. <laughs> My attention span is not that bad, shush. Have no fear, simple citizens. The freelance police are here to keep the peace. Violently, if possible, you called. It's just you two? Where's the SWAT team? Where's the National Guard? Where's that NASA? Crow? NASA? Hello, thank Hold you for the on, sub. Bosco, Appreciate it. What's the problem? It's a terrorist! A munchkin terrorist! He'll be the death of us all! A munchkin. Where is this Lilliputian agitator? Are you, you blind? He's right there! Spring. Hey, it's another no. one of the soda poppers! I don't Isn't he the one with the water control the issues? You? Yeah, wizard! <laughs> He's a former child star? Poe, just lock him up and throw away the jail! <laughs> exactly what is the nature of wizard's malfeasance? He's delivering videos I didn't even order! Brady Culture's Ibo? What is that? Oh, it's something bad, I can tell you that. Videos. And look at that display! It's subversive and hideous! I don't know any white guy with a fro oh like God. that. <laughs> I hear that. 
Oh, wait, it's your boobs. It's my boob. Yeah. My diggly. Any idea why a freakish relic of the 70s would unload videos in your store? Think about it. Big no individual acting alone would ever deliver <laughs> Thank videos you. of his own volition. Hmm. It makes no sense. I smell a conspiracy. I think you're just catching the hot weenies in an updraft. <laughs> no, it's definitely a conspiracy. Right. Hmm. Hmm. Have you actually witnessed this Ibo video with your own eyes? Only a fool would watch a strange video. You watch it. I mean, yeah, to be fair, you don't know if it's gonna be cursed and you get like a ghost coming out of your screen seven days later, you know? Very reasonable. One of us needs to take a couple dozen elephant tranquilizers and call it a day. And you should take a few yourself. How can I be calm with a Munchkin <laughs> terrorist in my store? Katie, very real, very real, very true. Chances to go around long looking good. Thank you. Very much I appreciated. Want to come out of my screen. <laughs> all right, all right. I think we got it. Okay, anything else? I don't know. I I think we'll chat more later, moment. Bosco. But right now, it's time to get up close and personal with that pint-sized evildoer. <laughs> Stop that crazy man before he kills us all! What? <laughs> you never know. It could be a video. Hey there, Mr. Wizard. No need to be formal. My friends just call me Wizard. <laughs> and so do my enemies and lots of people like you I've never met. Everyone calls me Wizard. What exactly are you doing here? Delivering videos! Take one! They're free! Are you aware that you're breaking the law? Come on, guys! There's no law against giving away free stuff! Unlawful deliveries are punishable under Section 9, Article 7, Title 11 of the Personal, Private, Public, Professional Conduct Penal Code. You made that up. True, but we could write him up for littering, <laughs> trespassing, and disturbing the peace. I have to deliver these videos. The penis Boy, code. What am I not annoyed. Can we arrest him now? In a minute, little buddy. <laughs> What's the story with these videos? Brady Culture's Ibo is the ocular fitness regimen for people on the go. <laughs> the fucking. <laughs> Did Bosco actually order this many videos? How should I know? And did I mention they're free? What, you just deliver them whether people order them or not? The word must be spread! Ibo is the path to enlightenment! <laughs> oh, and ocular fitness. fitness, oh my god. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. What can you tell me about Ibo? Ibo is a revolutionary new program of isometric exercises to promote ocular fitness. You can learn to move objects with your eyes, even see through walls and clothing. Damn, that sounds nice. Clothing. You gotta watch this tape. It changed my life. Would be nice to see through clothing. You guys, you guys should watch the video. I'm sure there's something here that you guys would really like to see. But I'm doing well, Bonds. Thank you. Thank you for asking. Welcome. I think this is a cult. Yeah, this is definitely a cult. Absolutely. Well, that's nice. What is? <laughs> uh, yeah, you're under arrest. Your hands on Fuck your head. You. You're under arrest. Oh, come on. It's a free country. I whoa, thought this whoa, was whoa. America. <laughs> this guy's suffering from some pretty severe delusions. <laughs> Seriously now, you're under arrest. Come on, you don't have to make a federal case out of it. No, we don't have to. We want to. Yeah, I want to. <laughs> How many times do I have to say you're under arrest? Seriously now, you're under arrest. Come on, you don't have to make a federal case out of it. Aw. No, we don't really? have to. Really? I can't we arrest him? To. Can't arrest him for trespassing and loitering? Damn. 
If you'll excuse us, we've got shopping to do. Take a copy of the Ibo video while you're at it. It will change your life. So I can't arrest the guy. What the fuck do I... <laughs> nachos. nachos? They're mine, nachos. Uh, that was painful. <laughs> I mean, it was really funny, but it was painful. Sludgies. With 100% all natural sludge. This week's flavors, wheatgrass and meatloaf. Oh my god. <laughs> I think it's the tinge of green that makes this coffee especially appealing. <laughs> I take my coffee green, like my men. What? <laughs> Max, what the fuck green was that? Involving you, a microwave, and six and feet of aluminum foil. Will make us Go on. Maybe the another best time. Leader. <laughs> Like your puns? My puns are not painful. Ketchup, mustard, Don't be and mean. Purple stuff. As vaguely referred to on TV. Purple stuff? My favorite. Say, Max. I am not getting in that thing again. It took me weeks to get the fishy smell out of my fur. <laughs> also, Coco, pull out your gun on him, simple. Oh, I still have like the inventory from. Oh, I didn't. I didn't realize I still had my inventory from my previous. What? Ooh. Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. Clean up on L3. <laughs> what? <laughs> what was that? You okay, Sam? <laughs> All I'll right. Need a new skull, but otherwise, no complaints. I guess. Oscos is a gun-free zone. All right. Gun-free? Sartre was right. Purgatory really is a convenience store. Don't make me laugh, little buddy. It jiggles my sensitive cranium. All right, I guess. Can I use my boxing glove then? I'd rather punch other things. Oh, I can, like, punch myself. No, okay, no, this is not it. Uh... So I can, I can, like, select myself to punch, but I cannot select the guy. Okay, never mind. Free videos? Don't mind if I do. Brady Culture's Ibo for Ocular Fitness. The revolutionary isometric exercise. <laughs> What's so revolutionary about it? See through walls and clothing, roll your eyes at lightning speed, lose five pounds of eyeball fat. <laughs> Oh, good. I can never seem to lose that last five pounds. What do you say we start <laughs> off this movie night a little early today? I'll bring the caramel-coated sugar logs. All right, anything else we can do here? Special. Buy one, get one. What a wow. Deal. Nothing like a gaggle of security cameras pointed at a guy to make him feel at home. I'm comfortable with it, because I'm uncommonly photogenic. <laughs> oh, Max is so adorable. I love him. I love that you can just, like, fucking like, slap him out of the way. <laughs> I'll let you get back to your shopping. Or whatever it was you were doing. Sometimes it's best not to ask. <laughs> hmm, so what the... Fuck. Nah. Okay, just nah. Okay. Uh... Nothing like a gaggle of security cameras. Okay, that was just the same dialogue. At home. I'm comfortable God with damn. it because I'm uncommonly photogenic. What do I do about this guy if I can't fucking arrest him or anything? Public restrooms. Unholy temples to all things unsanitary. <laughs> I wouldn't go in there for all the TNT landia. I'll do it! Oh no. <laughs> I love that the sign has like a little bunny as well. Uh oh. Time out for number one! Looks like he opened his floodgates. I oh. hope he enjoys it as much as I did. Hmm. 
chilled and preserved fluids. I wonder if Bosco used the fluid sample I submitted. I hope not. Oh, he's out of the bathroom again. Hmm. Hey, wizard. Hi. My cousin's wife's dentist loved your show. <laughs> oh, yeah. Cousin's We've wife's always been a big hit with the dentists. Gee, I wonder why. Hey, kids, guzzle soda like the soda poppers, and you'll need so much expensive dental work, you can kiss college goodbye. <laughs> Max, your unbridled cynicism is like a breath of fresh air on a crowded subway. Oh, my God, I love that. <laughs> hmm. Any chance we could get you to sing the song from your old show? Yeah, the theme song. What was it called? It was called More Than Jerks. But I can't sing it. I'm too embarrassed. <laughs> sing. <laughs> sing it. Sing it now. Dance, puppet. Are you anything like the character you played on the TV show? Yeah, like do you really have to hit the John every five minutes? Sometimes every three minutes. It's like having a superpower. <laughs> Orange, hello. Welcome. Well, that's nice. What is? If you'll excuse I us, I have no fucking idea what to do. do. Take a copy of the Ibo video while you're at it. It will change your life. We got one. Thanks. Hmm. I can finally be sub. Hey, Maya. Hello. Why do? Why does it never show up your notifications though? <laughs> <laughs> Why does the thing never show up when you do? <laughs> oh my god. I don't get it. I don't get why it doesn't play the <laughs> notification. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, Maya. But hello, how you doing? How you doing? Been a while. Go back to the office and watch a video. I just, I'm just supposed to fucking leave? Really? I'm just supposed to not do anything? <laughs> I mean, I guess I am a cop, so that, that does make sense. Twitch fucking hates me. It's it's not even showing up, like, on my on my feed of, like, recent activity or anything like that. Like, I don't know why it doesn't show up, but thank you, Maya. I appreciate it a Remember lot. Remember our old car, Max? I said I was sorry! It is so weird. It is so weird that for you specifically, it never shows up. Like, but, but it's funny because, like, you do have the subscriber badge. You do have, like, the subscriber badge. It just doesn't sh show up. Just the notification doesn't show up. Why is everything so dark in here now? How do I turn on the lights? Oh, there it is. Yeah, that was that was way too dark. Uh, no comment. Oh yeah, I need. To, I probably need to I put the PCR at the supermarket. So you know, it's a good one. Still smells like asparagus, though. <laughs> Using Prime Seven, let me. Have it. I am so sorry, Maya. Okay, Max, ready for that ocular workout? No, stop! We don't have any popcorn. Sweet alligator dentures soaking in formaldehyde. That was close. Quick, before it starts. <laughs> Hello, I'm Brady Culture. You may remember me from Culture's Clubhouse, <laughs> the, the massive worldwide television hit that ran for six episodes in 1970. I'm so happy because I can support you. Aww. You are about to Thank see you. Thank you, Maya. Forever. So watch closely. Now listen up, you tasteless Philistines. Oh my god. We're getting hypnoed. You adore me. You want to name all your children after me. I love you. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I adore you. I want to name all my children after you. Sam, look. Ocular fitness, my eye. <laughs> that videotape hypnotized Jimmy Two Teeth. I think I like him better this way. We've got Maine, to find this culture and stop him before he hypnotizes every consumer of cheap self-help videos. Ooh, can I Sporty Coke was the best done? thing ever. Aww. You keep it on leash. Look at those. <laughs> she needs a lot of support. <laughs> God, dude. I mean, it's true, though. It's true. 
How you doing, Maine? Welcome, welcome back. Bimbo noses. It was, it was actually a bimbo brainwashing video. You guys were right all along. Hmm. Yoo-hoo, tiny hoodlums. Twitch is like Amazon, they only want money. <laughs> I mean, Twitch is Amazon. Glad you're okay, man. Glad you're doing all right. I support Coco making bimbo hypno videos for us. <laughs> all right, so... I didn't even know that the name of the store was like Bosco's Inconvenience. Who's there? Yeah, it's just you. Hey, Bosco. What can I do for you? I guess. Uh. Oh, I thought I would be able to like talk to him about the videos or something. I don't know. About the Munchkin terrorism. Yeah, what about it? BTADs? Is that one of those acronym things I've been hearing so much about? Yep. Bosco Tech Automated Defense System. I made it myself. <laughs> wow, I always wanted to automate my defense. How does it work? Well, just pull a weapon. You'll see. Or try to walk out of here with something. Go ahead. I dare you. <laughs> Maybe we will. <laughs> All right. I think we got it. Okay, anything else? See you later, Bosco. Remember... We never had this conversation. Okay. What conversation? The conversation we just had. No, see, he was just acting like he'd already forgotten the conversation. What conversation? <laughs> oh, brother. <laughs> God damn it. Um, hmm. I think I'm gonna have to leave, though. Have fun tonight, girl. Oh, no worries, Maya. Thank you. Thank you, though. I appreciate a lot that you, you like, drop by. <laughs> That you drop by and leave us up. I'm so sorry that Twitch is not showing your, your notification. I don't know why. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hmm. Oh, this is literally just like shooting at the awesome. thing. Here, three. Hey! That one worked. That one worked somehow. <laughs> like, I don't. But thank you, Maya. Thank you very much. Coco shoot the nerd with glasses for vandalism. I want to go around shooting and killing people mm. for no reason. I understand that I am a cop, but I am, you know, I am role playing. I'm role playing a fantasy scenario where cops don't do that. <laughs> I mean, all right. What if I? Can I drop a fucking bowling ball on him nope. or something? No. All right. Fine. Caffeine rush. Sweet carbonated beverages and a pig trough. He's gone. What? Who would have thought such tiny legs could move so fast? Wow. You made me mess up. What was that? I don't get it. I really have no idea what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing now. Or Max. <laughs> oh my god, they're they're like putting the guy everywhere. They say graffiti is the poetry of our time. Just what we need. More lame poetry. Are you supposed to talk about the tape? I thought so, but Bosco doesn't seem to have any new dialogue options. Tampering with then the mail is a federal offense, offense punishable by help. fine and imprisonment. As we found out after the incident with the garden hose. Ah, memories. <laughs> Sybils. That's the name of the goat lady from Pseudo Regalia. Oh my god, there's another one of these boys. 
Welcome! You look like you could use some therapy! Not from a wide-eyed circus freak like you... Hey, it's another one of the soda poppers! Me? Right, you're, uh... Peepers! I don't know what you're talking about! My name is Sybil Pandemic, licensed psychotherapist! <laughs> Are you sure your name is Sybil, not Peepers? Absolutely! <laughs> Sybil Pandemic, licensed psychotherapist, that's me! He's trying to pull a fast one, Sam. Where's your gun? Violence is not the answer. <laughs> Since when? <laughs> Sam, we're dealing with a dangerously delusional psychotic here. Absolutely Obviously. true. This is like going to analysis. <laughs> Certainly. Tell me what's bothering you. Hmm. It's not me. <laughs> it's not me. It's Max. Hey. <laughs> he thinks he's a rabbit. I am a rabbit! See? Yes, well, I would recommend Brady Culture's eyeball <laughs> oh my video fucking for this God. situation. Good eye health helps combat delusions! The civil plot. Oh, man, I'm so sorry. Yes, my runny poached egg-like eyes could Violence use is workout. always the answer. You're you right, Grim. You regret it! <laughs> Good for him. All right, all right, we'll gun him. Excuse me for a minute, would you? Sure! I can see you! Whoa! Where'd he go? Hey, there he is! <laughs> you attacked a licensed psychotherapist? How could you? Just comes naturally, I guess. <laughs> oh my god. Ryan, hello. How you doing? How's it going? Welcome. Thank God! I've been locked in that closet so long I was starting to invent life stories for the mothballs! Oh, I've no. gotta sit down. <laughs> oh my God! He's still here? Call a cop! You're in luck, ma'am. Sam and Max. We're freelance police. <laughs> freelance police, Civil I pandemic. love that. <laughs> Licensed psychotherapist, nice to know ya. Arrest that lunatic immediately! But he's my pal! <laughs> I thought psychotherapists didn't use words like lunatic. Really? Does it say that in the handbook? Oh my the psychotherapist's God. <laughs> handbook or the lunatic's handbook? There's a difference? <laughs> What's the charge? Assault! Kidnapping! Identity theft! Those are good charges. <laughs> Some of my favorites! And what about mopery? He locked me in oh the closet God, and he's great. been pretending he's me! Gadzooks! Why? Well, these cases can be very complicated and delicate. There may be repressed feelings of inadequate transfer <laughs> or latent unwarranted hypochondriac Freudianism. Come again? He's a complete whack job. Although actually, now that I look closely, I think he's been hypnotized. <laughs> My god. Great thundering jellyfish on the squishy road to mayhem. Hypnosis. Yep, that's what I said. <laughs> Are there steps we can take? Soothing music, or perhaps some sort of invasive surgery? Shock treatment! Shock treatment! Typically, a hypnotic <laughs> state can be revised after I love rendering Max. the subject susceptible to new input. Sorry, I don't speak psychotherapist. You've got to knock them unconscious to bring them out of it. Oh, knock nice. Them unconscious! Now you're talking! I can demonstrate on this guy if you'll knock him out for me. I prefer hypnosis. Consider it done! Hypnosis. <laughs> All right, that's perfect. I can see you! What? Please, Please stop doing cooking. that! So how do I knock him unconscious? I can see you! Whoa! Where'd he go? Hey, there he is! You attacked a licensed psychotherapist? How could you? Just comes naturally, I guess. I just used a bowling ball. So we can't use the gun, bowling ball, or boxing glove. They all have the same result. And then... Ah, the Tiki. Pulled over from the days when mm. you could sell all kinds of cheap crap without a successful children's television show. Envious? A little. Not on him directly. Get out of his view? I don't think that's how, that's how it works. I mean, how the fuck do I get out of his view? Like, I can't fucking... 
I don't think that's gonna be. I can see you. What? But please stop doing that. What can you tell me about this Ibo videotape thing? Oh, it's marvelous. Change my mm. mind. You should watch it as soon as you possibly can. I think those might be iron-ons. Convenient and painful. A surefire hit with the average consumer. <laughs> Diplomas. Impressive credentials. Thank you. Hey, those are mine. I'm Symbol Pandemic. <laughs> oh, of course you are, dear. Of course. <laughs> um. Oh, there's like... Ah, taxidermy. The dead are truly the kitchen of the living. And vice versa. You're an unfathomable well of something, Max. <laughs> nice cactus. Saguaro? Vinyl. Hey, if you dip that in ink, you could do 30 tattoos at once. If I could scare up 30 customers at once, I'd still be in the tattoo business. <laughs> mm. I feel like I need to get something else in order to, like... It's eerily lifelike for a fake plant. The same can be said for a lot of our friends. <laughs> oh. I guess I need to get something else in order to beat him unconscious or something? Dead end. One way, dead end. Street signs are such fitting metaphors for the human condition. <laughs> Remind me to refill your prescriptions. Oh my god. I once hid in that dumpster to escape a rampaging gorilla. <laughs> I still don't know how she got out of the office. I was sure I locked the door. <laughs> uh. Hmm. Hmm. Still trying to figure out what the fuck they do, man. Where are we going, Sam? No place. Never mind. <laughs> Looks like there's going to be a lawnmower show. Great! Uh. I love riding mowers. They're like golf carts with teeth. Lefties. This place used to be Lefty's tool rental shop. Good old Lefty. I'll miss him. You couldn't stand Lefty. You once poked him in the eye with a number three socket spanner. <laughs> exactly! Good times. Oh no. Go pull over random motorists? I mean, I guess there's nothing else we can do right now. At least nothing, not that I can figure out. Where are we going, Sam? Let's go cruise for lawbreakers, Max. Goody! By the way, Sam, I'm not sure if I mentioned this, but I may have accidentally chewed through our brake lines. No, I don't think you did mention that. <laughs> I guess we'll just have to slow down by violently rear-ending other motorists. Oh, oh my god, on, little buddy. <laughs> Click to steer? What? Oh, you can, like, drive by clicking? That That's fucking awful. Us. <laughs> what? This is your first and final warning. Pull over or die. <laughs> Drug the <laughs> fucking, <laughs> fucking license plate. Oh my god. We call the shots around here. Oh, why did you stop me? Gradually excessive speed, dangerously reckless driving. Hit these tail lights busted. No, it isn't. Well, maybe it should be. Mental note: Try to pull over suspects who are actually guilty of something.
You can you can shoot out a taillight with a gun. Then use the megaphone to get them to pull over and find them for a broken taillight. Oh my god. We're just gonna ignore that his fucking license plate was drug dealer. Okay, cool. Take the wheel, little buddy. With pleasure. Oh my god. Please accept my condolences for your taillight. <laughs> How the fuck are you supposed to do this? Like Sam one taillight. So quickly, zero. I can't, I can't change. I could do this all day. All right. Actually real. Greetings, anonymous motorist. And now this one was if arms dealer. Us, now would be the appropriate time. <laughs> What's the charge? Your tail lights busted. But you're the ones who broke it. <laughs> Your point being. Hmm. What's the fine for a broken tail light? Why isn't it ten thousand dollars? What? Are you crazy? One second. Allow me to confer with my legal counsel. <laughs> <clears throat> my attorney has advised me to pay the fine. Now, if you'll excuse us, we got some accounting to do. Thanks, Perfect. sucker! Amazing. <laughs> oh my fucking god. <laughs> it's a good bit of money. Yeah, I can see. I can see now. What the fuck? Please accept my condolences for your taillight. <laughs> oh my god. Fall over! Don't worry, we just want to talk! <laughs> we just want to talk? <laughs> Isn't this extortion? Hello, I mean, or pretty madam. much, yes. You're in big trouble, mister! Or miss! For what? You are swerving all over the road like a drunken roller skater on wet ice. <laughs> that was you! Oh, yeah. We'll take it ourselves later. For now, we have more innocent victims to pull over. <laughs> Ta ta. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, that's amazing. I love this. And what are the ramps? Oh, my God. There are actually ramps I didn't even realize. <laughs> oh, my God. That is fucking amazing. All right, so like the game is not even pretending that we're good cops in any capacity. That is that is good. Sam one tail lights. <laughs> tail lights zero. All right, all right. We'll just we'll just extortion. We'll just extort one more person, and we'll go back to like trying to do actual actual investigating. Hello. Know why we stopped you? No, why? Really? I was hoping you'd know. Seriously, why? <laughs> Ferret impersonation, that, that is jail. That is jail. You cannot impersonate the ferret. How dare you? Your taillight's busted. But you're the ones who broke it. Your point being... I hereby sentence you to life in prison. <laughs> <laughs> for a broken tail light? Report to the nearest correctional facility at your earliest convenience. <laughs> Life in away. prison. Oh my god. That is fucking great. I love that. <laughs> I prefer ferret impregnation. Ayo. Ayo. I, I want to see what, what the ferret impersonation does. I want to see the dialogue on that. Pull to the left. Pull to the right. Pull anywhere you want. Just fight, fight, fight. <laughs> We're literally just fucking harassing people in the street. Hello. This is great. Know why we stopped you? No, why? Yeah, why? I'm sorry, I mistook you for a ferret. And as you know, ferrets are not permitted to drive in this state. But I'm not a ferret! Well, that's what it looks like from here. Come on, Max. Let's go find some other unsuspecting driver to accuse <laughs> of made-up crimes. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Ferret impregnation is a public service. <laughs> oh my god. That was that was that was great. That was so funny. 
I still don't know how the fuck to like get any of these like Weezer guys. The fuck do I do with them? Well, I mean, if ferrets can equip like Coco, then I can't imagine they could drive. <laughs> Yeah, like, I mean, it's true. There is probably a good reason why ferrets can't drive. That looks comfortable. Oh, it is. How would you know? You don't have a tattoo. Don't I? <laughs> I've got half a mind to stretch out for a little bit. I think you have to stretch the whole thing or it rips. You baffle me sometimes, Max. <laughs> This guy's hard. This guy's fast, and he's got good eyes, so I doubt I can sneak up on him. If I remember Take out his eyes, then. You get the Thanks, you're a big help. Store. Gotta get the cheese from Bosco's store? Now I kinda want to see Coco trying to fit behind the wheel of a car. <laughs> remember that time you had therapy? Yeah, the court will never make that mistake again. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Let's look around. Great idea! Hmm. Oh, I can move with WASD, that's nice. It's eerily loud. The same could be. Didn't want to pick that. Seems like this, you typically spend a lot of time getting all the responses from people you might need to do. Make sure you've seen every response. Hmm, that could be the case. I don't know, let's see. Let's see at Bosco. Hello. Well, it is on special. And we are running dangerously low. <laughs> hey, Bosco. What do you need? We'd like to patronize your fine establishment, my good man. <laughs> By patronize you, he means we want to buy stuff from you, not mock you. We probably will <laughs> mock you, but that's not what he meant. I know what he meant. Don't patronize me. So, what do you want to buy? Okay, Mac, we want this cheese. Okay, standard cheese background check. I need to see at least six forms of ID, a valid federal cheese <laughs> license, a fuck? completed organ donor card, a written release signed in the presence of a notary public, and your school report cards from the 9th through 12th grades. <laughs> Fucking amazing. That's pretty inconvenient. It's okay, Sam. I can be brave. We'll just have to struggle cheeselessly onward. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have any weasels on a stick? Nope. Do you have any two-handed broadswords? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Do you have any vegetables in the shape of famous naturalists? Nope. Do you have any candy pink fat boys? Nope. <laughs> Do you have any exiled political dissidents? Oh nope. my god. <laughs> Do you have any weapons of mass destruction? <gasps> Who's asking? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Do you have any... Hmm, I've run out of ideas. Well, you can always just start over again. Good idea. <laughs> what have you got? Well, I I've still got that big sale on cheese. Oh, yeah, cheese. I want that. And I might have another item of interest behind the counter. Hmm? I accept your thinly veiled invitation to ask about the item behind the counter. Oh, it's no. just a little something. No. I like to no. call a tear yes. gas grenade launcher. No. Tear gas grenade launcher? Oh, grenade yeah, launcher? I really want that. Well, it's the latest in Bosco Tech innovation. It'll clear out any room in no time guarantee. That sounds good. I feel really close to you right now. <laughs> we got your tear gas money right here. Really? Well, all right. Here you go. One tear gas grenade launcher. Amazing. This is a salad shooter filled with onions. But it works. Trust me. Trust me. Now put that away before someone gets All hurt. Alright, I feel like I, I know what to do now. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. The 10,000 just cover the cost of materials, you know? Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> it's okay, everybody. I'm alright. Oh my god, I love this. What? Oh! Oh yes, oh, because did you see that? Oh, we have the cheese. Yeah. Attention shoppers, the cheese ain't free. I forgot we had the cheese. Sam, are you dead? 
Too early to tell. No one steals from Bosco. <laughs> An honest but excruciatingly painful mistake. So I guess we'll just leave Let's the Let's just return the cheese to its table. Okay. <laughs> Alright, now we can leave. And I'm pretty sure we can use the fucking tear gas. To, to get I'm the other one. Did you get the wizard to sing the song yet? Uh, no, he just said that he's shy. Didn't didn't press 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 much on that. <laughs> Where can I throw tear gas? Exactly. Oh, Sybil. Yes. Uh, the other Sybil. What is that? Don't worry. This won't hurt a bit. <laughs> but it will make you cry. Amazing. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Please, Sam, allow me. Now, peepers, this is going to hurt us a lot more than it's going to hurt you. Just kidding. It'll definitely hurt you more. Sweet dreams, peeps. Die. Police brutality. You. Perfect. <laughs> oh, my. That was great. That was great. I mean, wait. My evil plan is being threatened. Good thing I have the other two twerps to handle it. Mwahahaha! Uh, it's still not quite right. Mwahahaha! Uh. Nice work, you two. Now I can try to bring him out of his hypnotic state. Take control of your mind! I don't think he can hear you. <laughs> sure he can. He's <laughs> unconscious, <laughs> not dead. Mwahahaha! <laughs> Destroy the intruder in your dreams. Regain control. What? Hey, what am I doing here? What's going on? Sybil? My name's not Sybil. It's Peepers. <laughs> uh, yes, it is. Are you okay? How do you feel? I've got a bit of a headache. I had the nice. weirdest dream. <laughs> and there was someone unusual in your dream, wasn't there? Yes, Brady Culture was there! He kept telling me to do stuff. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! That fiend hypnotized you to do his unspeakable bidding. Peepers, what's the last thing you can remember? I remember checking in at Brady Culture's home for former child stars. <laughs> he has his own nut house? Wow, we gotta meet this guy. Oh, Where can no. we find this home for former child stars? Oh, it's very A home for former no child stars? Think of a scandal! But we need to find it so we can stop the madness, in a manner of speaking. I want to help, but I just can't remember where it is. Oh. But my brothers might. They went with me. Uh, hey, I, I didn't do anything really embarrassing, did I? Nothing a simple exorcism can fix. Oh, dear! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love that. Hey, Doc. Hey, Sam. Thanks for taking care of that wacko. I wish there was some way I could repay you. Money would be a good way. <laughs> it's another 10 grand. Max might like it to do. You fix cars. Max might like a tattoo. Oh yeah, I want a map of the Netherlands on my Netherlands. I get the cold shivers just <laughs> thinking about remembering hearing you say that. I'm out of the tattoo oh, business anyway. I'm a licensed psychotherapist. <laughs> Have you got 10 grand? I'm new at this. I have a lot of student loans. Great! Loan Rip. us a student! I can ride it around like a pony! It's nice to see you show such enthusiasm! Security. <laughs> Security. Uh. Can you fix cars? Ours sometimes makes a noise like an orangutan with the dry heaves. Um, that's my fault. I've been keeping an orangutan in the trunk. Oh, never mind. I'm not much of a mechanic anyway. Except with unicycles. <laughs> I suppose you could psychoanalyze me. Hey, yeah, I could count your marbles for you. I have a license, you know. Will this be painful? <laughs> Only if we do it right. Now, there are a couple of things we can <laughs> we try. Only do we it could right. some ink blots. We could try some pre association. Oh. I could interpret your dreams for you. Mm, let's try free association. What's free association like? It's a test of your reactions to things in your life. I say a word, and then you just say or do the first thing that comes into your head. Dance a samba, recite the alphabet, scream at the top of my lungs, that sort of thing? Hmm, interesting. 
Have we started already? <laughs> no, but now we will. Ready? Is that the AKA word? The no, the word is wanted talented Humble children weed. orphanage. <laughs> talent. Unwanted talent. Children orphanage. Oh no. The, the phrase was tumbleweed. Gonna go with word it. to the wise. Never put your tongue on a cactus. Or vice versa. Trigger word causes strange culinary impulses. Possible organic malaise fixation. <laughs> now try this one. Crown. Crown? Hmm. I mean, Do you I think you... this would work better if I lie down? Subject wishes to assume supine position. Trigger word apparently inducing sleepiness. Comb. <laughs> Comb. What do you think of this free association stuff, Max? Seems like a crack of weak tea to me, Sam. <laughs> hmm. Dialogue with imaginary friend. <laughs> what imaginary friend? Hey, I'm not imaginary. <laughs> if you say so. Well, this has been illuminating. <laughs> What's the verdict? I'll um, let you know after years of insanely expensive treatment. Anything to support small local businesses. <laughs> we can always sell organs on the black market to raise the cash. Just so they're not ours, little buddy. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> Actually, let's save the psychoanalysis for later. Hmm, postponing responsibilities. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, that hits close. Oh shit, I clicked out of the I clicked out of the game. Lol. <laughs> Use Max to interact? With what? Swap with Max? How do I swap characters here? Let's look around. Great idea! Hmm. Coco, remember to swap to Max's dialogue. Oh, oh, you meant during the dialogue. Okay, okay. Thought, I thought like I could swap characters like walking around. Hey, Doc. Hey, Sam. I always do forget, but like, there's no option here to change to Max. How'd you like to shrink my head a little, Doc? Of course. What's your poison? Can you really learn anything from my grotesque, nonsensical dreams? Oh, absolutely. They reveal your subconscious. It's like peeling an onion. Youch! <laughs> now just relax and try to remember your dream. Okay, here goes. Oh? My dreams always start in the office. But this time, things were different. Mmm, yes, I can- Oh shit, I- God damn it, I skipped the dialogue. Fuck. I didn't mean to do that, fuck. Uh... I realized there was someone else in the room with me. Oh, you had a special guest. Who was it? It was... It was me! It was me! You? Hmm... I think you... Chill for dialogue team, for real. I didn't even that realize sucks. that was possible. Oh sure, any crazy thing's possible in psychoanalysis. Tell me. Did the other you say or do anything unexpected? No, the usual. Hi, Sam. How are you? I'm fine, Sam. And yourself? Not too shabby. Fascinating. <laughs> Where does your mind come up with this stuff? <laughs> I prepared to leap out of the window. Oh, was that the end of your dream? No. <laughs> no, wait, I forgot something. Oh, do continue. Then. I understand Tekken's plot better than the plot of Sam and Max. <laughs> I mean, it do be... It do be kind of... It do be very silly. Jesse I James, the then? Above the closet bearing Jesse James's severed hand. <laughs> well, only in a dream, huh? I didn't notice anything unusual there. Then why do you mention it? I don't know. Interesting. <laughs> I noticed something weird sticking out of the rat hole. Mmm. The rats are pests. They represent something bothersome. Tell me, what was in the hole? 
fish clacking balls or clacking balls it was that staple office oh. knickknack, <laughs> the clacking balls not unlike the ones on your desk oh do you not like the balls <laughs> no sybil i don't like the balls well you don't like the balls <laughs> nothing unusual there Hmm. I noticed something odd on the dartboard. Oh, something you're shooting for. What was your target? <laughs> to rush to diploma. A tattoo. It was a garish tattoo. Wow. Wow. That is so deep. <laughs> In other words, you don't know what it means. No. <laughs> Oh, I love that. Mm. Not a thing was on TV. Suggesting you feel television is an intellectual wasteland, devoid of any and all worthwhile content. So real. No, that can't be right. <laughs> I noticed something peculiar in the water cooler. Ah, the water cooler, a source of refreshment. What was in it? There was gun. It was a massive death-dealing revolver. You subconsciously find revolvers refreshing? <laughs> oh no, it's quite conscious, I assure you. <laughs> Hanging on the coat rack was a necktie in the shape of a noose. Oh my, Sam, I'm not sure how to put this, but I think you may need a therapist. Oh wait, I forgot I am one. <laughs> hmm, I don't know, what else? <laughs> I noticed something strange growing on my plant. Yes, the plant represents a source of sustenance. What was on it? It was... So It was a can of some unknown carbonated beverage. Uh, I think you need a dietitian, not a therapist. <laughs> the closet. All right, let's check. Let's check the closet. I noticed something bizarre in the closet. Yes, we put things in the closet we want to hide away. Things we're ashamed of. Please, Sam, what's in your closet? Camera on lottery tickets. Parking meter. <laughs> or nothing. A parking meter. A parking meter? Why would you possibly be ashamed of that? Well, we did run over the meter in front of our building once or twice. <laughs> or every single time we ever parked there. <laughs> oh, that's great. The donut box, you're right, you're right. Let's check the donut box. I remembered that I'd just gotten something from the bakery. Oh, sounds like you and your special guests there were having a little celebration. What did you get? Mm. It was Jeez. a cheesecake. And I mean literally, a piece of cheese in a cake. What does that represent? <laughs> no, that doesn't mean anything. It's just random nonsense. <laughs> Gotta love that. I think that's it, though. Was that the end of your dream? <laughs> yes, then I woke yep, up screaming. Then I woke up screaming. I can see why. Ah, uh, that was funny. That was real funny. <laughs> Actually, let's save the psychoanalysis for later. Just random nonsense. Mm. Postponing responsibilities. Interesting. <laughs> the ink blots. Well, we'll check out other options other options later because i i do want to keep like <laughs> i don't want to be stuck in like one dialogue tree just like forever I want, and i want to see what grim said about like getting the guy to dance and to sing the 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 fucking theme song two bears high-fiving hello two bears <laughs> oh that post is great hey wizard Hi. Hmm. It was Have here, I right? I know someone who knows someone who loved your show. Doesn't everyone? 
Come on, sing the Soda Popper theme song. No, I don't think so. What'll it take to get you to sing that song? We'll be your best friends. <laughs> no. Are you sure you won't sing the Soda Popper song? I won't gnaw your leg off if you do it. No. We can't pull up the, the tear gas or the gun in the store. We get immediately knocked out. Come on, sing the Soda Popper song. Pretty please. No. Come on, sing the Soda Popper song. Mm. Ugly please. No. Ugly please. Come on, sing the Soda Popper song. I promise not to sing along. No. Mm. How about an autograph for my pal, Max? You could write to Max. Thanks for saving my life that time in San Remo. Gee, I don't really have time. I've got a lot more videos to deliver. <laughs> no time? Don't they give you bathroom breaks? <laughs> sure, but I don't sign autographs in there anymore. There was an incident. Didn't I see you on a TV commercial a while back? Yeah, what was it? Bowl Get the cheese from the office and replace the cheese on the table? Function? Ooh, that sounds oh, interesting. Free. <laughs> Come on, Come sing, on, the, sing the fucking song. song. No. Well, that's nice. What is? If you'll excuse us, we've got shopping to do. Take a copy mm. of the Ibo video while you're at it. It will change your life. We got one, thanks. All right, I still don't know. I, I think we can get him to go to the bathroom. If we if we can get Max to go to the bathroom. But like, I don't know what to do when he's gone. We can go up and get the other cheese and see if we can like... We can go get the other cheese and see if we can just like replace that. You remember. Hmm. Okay, let, let me try and figure it out. I don't need any more cheese. You're telling me. We don't need more cheese? What do you mean? We don't we don't even have one. I don't need any more cheese. You're telling me. Oh rip. Hey, that that doesn't work. Um uh, What could we use? We can get him to go to the bathroom. Hello. Yes, we've already checked the, uh, the the tape on the VCR. It hypnotized the mouse or the rat in the house. Hmm. Oh, fun! Oh, no worries, no worries. Yeah. <laughs> Uh oh. Time out for number one. All right. Uh uh. No. I'd rather punch other things. I don't know. No. Nope. Immediately get. Ooh. Ooh. He's in his... Oh! Whee! Put the cheese in his crate. Oh, I get it now. Okay. Discounted cheese is nine. All right, all right. That makes sense. Sense. You got knocked out. Yeah, you get knocked out for pulling out a oh, gun. <laughs> Uh-oh. Time out for number one. Oh. Yeah, honestly, I wouldn't. I wouldn't have thought of that. <laughs> if you really love someone, give them the gift of cheese. Oh, I just can't wait to see the look on his face when he gets it. Perfect. What the? Time out for number one. 
We're saved! That's a whole lot more entertaining when it's not happening to me. It's pretty entertaining either way. <laughs> oh, he wet his widow pants. <laughs> classic. Just classic. Except, hold on. My evil plan is in jeopardy. Who dares to oppose me? Hey, that was pretty good. <laughs> you better, better. Ew. Hey, you just gonna leave him then? Uh. Ew. Ew. Don't wanna see that shit. Ha <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so what the fuck do we do with this guy <clears throat> now? Uh, take control of your mind. Is it working? I don't know. Destroy the intruder in your dreams. Snap out of it, you big baby! Oh, what's going on? <laughs> Where? Where's the bathroom? He's back. Quick, act like a chicken. Yeah. No. Tell us where we can find Brady Culture's home for former child stars. We've got to stop that fiend from hypnotizing anyone else. The home? It's a two two seven something. Specs would remember the street. He always does the navigating. Can you take us there? Heck no! I've got to take some time out for number one. <laughs> Well, that was oh, helpful. No. <laughs> Point of the lap. <laughs> hmm. All right. So, how do we get this guy now? Hey, quit it, Brain Freeze. Looks like this stuff doesn't work on people who wear glasses. Hmm. Caffeine Rush! He always sees us coming. You made me mess up! Uh huh. I once hid in that dumpster to escape a rampaging gorilla. I still don't know how she got out of the office. I was sure I locked the door. Mm, can't hide there. It says they've bred a horse with eight legs. Does it run twice as fast? No, but it does eat twice as much. <laughs> it says cloning rights activists are cloning themselves to create a bigger voting block. It works for locusts. I don't remember if the videotape plays something different each time you watch it or not. Okay, that could be interesting. We could try checking the videotape again. And risk being hypnotized? Not on your life. Alright, so not. Try firing your gun out your office window. Mm. Oh. Hey, a can of spray paint, and it's not even empty. Oh, can I mess up his fucking graffiti or something? Caffeine rush. Oh wait, no. He always I clicked coming. on him. No, no. You made me mess up. I don't want to get into a paint fight in my good suit. <laughs> uh. Wait. Watch the TV three times. All right, let's. They say graffiti is the poetry of our time. Just what we need. More lame poetry. Uh, uh, do we have to lure him there somehow? One of these days we're going to finish that game. I'm still working on getting the rest of the darts from the police impound. <laughs> On this week's edition of Oh, Is He Still Alive? 
we look at the stars of the 1970s television hit, The Soda Poppers. <laughs> I love shows that destroy all our cherished delusions about the stars we once loved. <laughs> oh, no. During the Soda Poppers' heyday, young Spex was the role model for obsessive neat freaks all over the globe. Ticker tape free, ticker tape parades were thrown in honor of the Soda Popper, who never missed a spot. Backstage, though, things were quite a bit dirtier. Speck's obsession with perfection caused massive delays in shooting and infuriated co-workers. He famously <laughs> demanded over 11,000 retakes of the line, You made me mess up! Made all the oh, more no. annoying because of his tendency to repeat the line immediately after reading it. Following the show, Spex was rarely seen in public, although he did make one ill-fated venture into celebrity tag team mud wrestling, getting pinned in a tag record three seconds wrestling. as he desperately tried to wipe down the ring with a dish rag. The meltdown utterly enraged his tag team oh partner my God. and good friend, the dog <laughs> from My Mother the Dog, who stormed out of the arena without a word. They haven't spoken since. Coming up next, the soda popper oh my God, I love always keep it in. That is just fucking amazing. Cover the graffiti outside your office with the spray paint, I would guess. I mean, that would make sense, yeah. That at least is... plausible. That doesn't need another coat. No. This could use a little improvement. It up. Oh, now I've got to fix it, brain freeze. Oh, perfect. So now we lured him there. And we can... We can take him on from the office window. Oh, that's perfect. You know, I was gonna name the stream Bimbo Tries to, to Play... Sam and Max, but apparently titling the stream Bimbo uh, is not allowed by Twitch. Can you believe we get paid for this? <laughs> I love this country. <laughs> you oh made me God. mess up. We're just fucking <laughs> knocking out people now left and right. This is quality television. <laughs> That's so dumb. It is. In a second. My evil plan is in ruins. The dog and bunny will rue the day they crossed me! Rue the day, I say! <laughs> <laughs> well, we've admired our handiwork long enough. Maybe just one more second? Okay, let's go. It's not an insult so many people identify as bimbos these days. For real, like, not even not even joking. I don't really think it's, a, it's an insult. Especially if you're using it for yourself, you know? I can understand that it can be taken as an insult or others, but like... I am Take calling myself a bimbo. Why am I not allowed to dreams. put it on the title Nicely of the done, stream? Sam. You're a natural. <laughs> Where am I? Who are you? Don't worry, we're freelance police. Police? Oh no! Oh my god. Quick, follow that soda popper. Car chase. Hurry, Let's Sam. go. He's getting away. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Do, do I have to shoot him? With pleasure. Let's go. Got him. We busted his time. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Don't shoot! Aside from the fact that we just plugged your truck, why would you think we'd shoot you? Except for the obvious sport value, of course. It's just, you always <laughs> see cops value. on the news beating up on some guy just because he's a former child star. We would never <laughs> dream of hurting former child stars. We just need to find the home where Brady Culture keeps them. Oh, why didn't you say so? It's right over there, across the street. I love Jumping this. Jumping elephant fleas. How devilishly convenient! How Thanks. convenient, yes. <laughs> Very convenient. Uh, does anyone know how to change a tire? Max is really great. Max is so funny. I love him. <laughs> Quote unquote home for former child stars. 
Uh, Not much of a secret, is it? Yeah, not really. Looks like a shifty character to me. Don't they all? The <laughs> mole man. This one's very locked. Admission. Hmm. It says here they only treat patients with something called artificial personality disorder. Sounds tasty. What's in it? Apparently it's common in former child stars. Hmm. Symptoms include, uh, let's see, obsession with fame, violent reactions to dentistry, and an unconscious desire to marry one's mother. <laughs> Forsooth! Oh no. You don't even know what that means, do you? No, but it sounds all classically literate. Oh hey, you're playing the Telltale series of Sand and Max Amis. Yes, we're just we're just starting with the the first one, the first episode of Sam and Max Save the World. The power of Ibo. Looks more like the glower of Ibo. Can you take a form? I don't think I can, but let's see. Hmm. It says here they only treat patients with something called artificial personality disorder. Apparently it's common yeah, no, in it's former child just... stars. This console or PC? It's PC. Uh, PC version. Obsession with fame, violent reactions to dentistry, and an unconscious desire to marry one's mother. Hmm. Insert forms here. I guess this is where you stick your admission form. Disturbing little monkey. Reminds me of a job I had once. You were a monkey? Essentially. <laughs> Locked. So bad you don't have a diagnosis for artificial personalities or the drug therapist. Hmm. Do we have to go to the therapist again? Do we have to go to Sybil? Alright, let's... Where are we going, Sam? Uh, let's head back to the office. Back to the office. You checked the box? Oh no, I didn't check the box. Fuck. I mean, I appre and by the way, I appreciate hints, but like, please, please try to not outright tell me the answer. <laughs> Unless I'm just asking to. Um, unless I'm asking for the answer itself, like. Hmm. Do you think I might have artificial personality disorder? Oh, we did grab mm. one of them. Interesting. Symptoms include, uh, let's see, obsession with fame, violent reactions to dentistry, and an unconscious desire to marry one's mother. <laughs> hey, I know! I could psychoanalyze you! Oh, nice. <laughs> uh, right How do ink blots work? And can we make them ourselves? It's easy. I just show you some pictures, and you tell me what you see. No worries, Gavlo, it's fine. Your can reveal <laughs> things like obsessions, or uh, obsessions. <laughs> Take a look at this, and tell me what you see. A mothman? Oh, I, act I actually see like like a lobster. This is pennies on the eyes of a dead mine. A pair of opening, a pair of open a box of oxen boxing in a rain of a, in a rowboat. Susan Lucci holding an Emmy. I don't know who that is. The results of the last time I let Max. Drive. The results of the last time I let Max drive. All right. Two bears high five. Now, how about this? <laughs> Two bears. <laughs> Uh, a bunch of bacteria playing basketball. Pigeons on the marquee at the man's Chinese theater. An SUV crashing into an opulent mansion. St. Valentine's Day Massacre. The St. Valentine's Day Massacre. And this? An Emmy's on a word for it. No, I know what an Emmy is. I just don't know who the person they referenced was. <laughs> Uh, my uncle Louis mouth eaten <laughs> moth eaten what? Uh, coded love notes from space aliens. An autograph written in braille. My uncle Louis moth eaten wallet. Now this one. What do you see? The mm -hmm. Saint Valentine's Day massacre is a dark reference. Oh damn! Is that a, like an actual thing? I thought it was just like random nonsense. 
Elephants at the New York Stock Exchange, a cheering crowd of lanky albinos. Exhausts painful at the break. <gasps> oh, sorry. Of a breath truck. 20 nuns with machine guns. 20 nuns with machine guns out for vengeance. <laughs> and this one? I did not know that the Valentine's Day Massacre was a thing. Oh no. Oh damn, it's dark. Mm, that blotchy thing with a flashbulb. <laughs> that blotchy thing had a flashbulb those to your eyes. An orangutan escaping from the trunk of a DeSoto. War between two teams of Astrax shapes. The same Valentine's Day Massacre was the oh, murder rip. of seven members and associates of Chicago's Northside Gang on St. Valentine's God Day damn. 1929. The men were gathered at a Lincoln Park, Chicago garage on the morning of February 14, 1929. They were lined up against a wall and shot by four unknown assailants, two of whom were disguised as police officers. God damn. God damn, this is the first time I hear about <laughs> Coco don't know American lore. Yeah, I don't know American lore. I'm sorry. <laughs> An orangutan trying to escape from the trunk of a DeSoto. Hmm, your responses are kind of all over the map. I can't tell a whole lot from them. Sorry. Thanks, Doc. Do you think I might have artificial personality <laughs> disorder? Maybe, but people with APD are known for their Coco. obsession with How fame. many rings did that cost? <laughs> I mean, everything's free when your sugar daddy pays for it. Pull them out. No. <laughs> but thank you. I'm glad you like the new look. Um, let's try some more free association. Let's examine my unconscious. Let's try some more free association. That All would right. tell us more about your unreasonable you know reactions really to the elements dude. of your life. Remember, I'll say <laughs> words me. and you just do I'm or say whatever daddy. comes naturally. <laughs> Ready? Sure, go ahead. Cow. Cow? This reminds me of a cat I had once. Trigger word brings up memories of cat. No, no, the fox does. Brings up memories of fox. <laughs> oh, the fox. Oh, forget it. Causes subject to forget foxes. Possible Alzheimer's. <laughs> How about this word? Drill. Drill. Max almost lost a finger in a fan like that once. Sugar yeah, daddy. but it wasn't you my own it? finger. Cooking <laughs> grizzly memories. Oh, thank you, Debbie. Appreciate it. <laughs> thank you very Just much. Just do or say whatever comes naturally. I, I I didn't hear what the words was. Drill. Eucalyptus. Drill. Interesting. Well, this <laughs> has been illuminating. Am I sane? The jury's still out. Your reactions didn't tell me anything conclusive. Do you think I might have artificial personality disorder? Maybe, but people with APD are known for their violent reactions to dentistry. Mm hmm. I'd like to tell you about another mundane but strangely compelling dream I had. All right, let's examine your disturbing subconscious desires a bit further. I really am not sure if I should be doing okay, like tell me answers what here, trying to like get a result, or if they're just made it for like the funny. By famous gangster Al Capone. It was the thing that led to people Foxy? getting sick. Foxy! Oh my God! Thank you for the thing. To him going to prison. <laughs> Thank you so much. Appreciated. God damn, thank you. Hmm. I realized there was someone else in the room with me. Oh, who was your special Aww, guest? Oh, Grim, thank you. Thank you as well. Thank you as well. Thank you very much. Alan, hello, Alan, and welcome. Thank you for the raid. How y'all doing? Alan Raid. Oh my god, everything's happening right now. <laughs> Thank you for the gifted subs. <laughs> Appreciate it. How you doing? How you doing, everyone? Welcome. Welcome to the stream. It was Bosco from the Inconvenience Store. Ah, yes. You go to him when you need things. Yes, he represents your father. Bosco's my daddy? <laughs> uh, symbolically, yes. Literally, no, Foxy's my daddy. Not. 
In your dream, was Bosco doing anything peculiar? He did say something rather unexpected. I may not show it much, but I love you, Sam. <laughs> now go wash my car. Yes, that's just what I expected. <laughs> no, go wash my car. I realized there was someone else in the room with love me. You, baby girl. Oh, who was your special guest? Oh, I love you too, Foxy. <laughs> Muchas gracias, Alan. Muchas gracias. Hmm. <laughs> It was you. Me? My, I'm fine my, my. With being the step oh, sugar daddy. I represent your mother. <laughs> you do. Of course. The feelings of trust, of safety. Besides, I figure the old hag's got to be in there somewhere. That's psychotherapy 101. Insightful. <laughs> Tell me, in your dream, was I doing anything queer? Anything you queer? Did say something pretty queer. You ungrateful pup! I went through three weeks of labor for you. Wow, <laughs> it is your mother. I was right, as I usually am. Amazing. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, you can change answers to fit the diagnosis. I don't know how I can get the violent reactions towards dentistry. How the fuck do we get that? Uh, the old case file is not a thing. Sam and Max queer moments. Very, very many queer moments in Sam and Max. Also, Demi, thank you. Thank you as well for the bits. Appreciate it. React with something violent? Hanging on the coat rack was a necktie in the shape of a noose. Oh my. Sam, mm -hmm. I'm not sure how to put this, but I think you may need a therapist. Oh wait, I forgot I am one. <laughs> I don't know. We've, we've been here already and we essentially got all the things out of the way. I mean, let's try to see what else. I realized Max there was someone was else there. in the room with me. I think that's oh, the only one we haven't, special guest. we haven't uh, selected. It was Max. Ah, oh, yes, your imaginary friend. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm standing right next to you, lady. In your dream, was Max doing anything unusual? <laughs> well, he was saying the Pledge of Allegiance to the tune of Camptown Races. I pledge allegiance to my gun, do-da, do-da. But that's not unusual. Remember, wanting to marry your mom is a I symptom. I realized there You're was right. someone else You're in right. the room with me. Oh, who was your special guest? It was you. Hmm, or was it really your mother? All right. Oh, I see. I see I what we're we're getting at. From the bakery. I get it now. For a celebration, perhaps. What did you get? A wedding cake. It was yes. a wedding cake, ripe for the toppling. Wait a second. Wedding cake. Your mother. You subconsciously want to marry your own mother. Well, this is a blow. <laughs> this is a definite <laughs> symptom of artificial personality Perfect. disorder. We did yes. it. I mean, I hope it's not serious. I'd better mark this on your chart. <laughs> Amazing. Very interesting. We should test you for the other symptoms of APD. Whatever you say, Sawbones. I'm not a Sawbones. I'm a psychotherapist. Sawbones? Tomato, tomato. Hey, I'm getting hungry. Sawbones slang for like surgeon or something? Played this game before. I can help you if you're stuck. Thank you. I appreciate that. I do appreciate the help sometimes, but like I do, I do want to try my best to like fucking make the cogs in my brain do something <laughs> i want to try to figure out <laughs> uh let's can we do some more obsession ink with those are entertaining ink sure let's take another look at your unseemly obsessions take a look at this and tell me because what they have bone sauce oh okay <laughs> uh pennies in the eyes of a dead mine susan susan lucci holding an emmy i don't know who susan lucci is now how about this one Hmm. An SUV crashing into an opulent mansion. And this? Sessions with fame. Scroll that gun around our toys. Coded love notes. An autograph, an autograph written. written in braille. braille. Yes. Now this one. What do you see? Right. Told you guys in machine guns. 
Nothing said the New York Stock Exchange. Elephants Probably. at the New York Stock Exchange. And this one? David Card, Fat Thrower, Document Shredder, an orangutan, the blotchy thing, a flashbulb, no, dusty rice. I mean, I would that assume that one. thing that a flashbulb does to your eyes. You seem fairly focused on fame, but it's probably Yay. nothing to worry about. Thanks, Doc. Do you think I might have artificial personality disorder? Maybe, but people with APD are known for their obsession with fame. What? I didn't get it? Can we do some more ink blot? Sure. Take a All look right. at this. Uh, holding Susan an Emmy is pretty obvious. I see. Yes. Now, how about this one? Play mask basketball. Pigeons on the marquee at Man's Chinese Theater. Maybe that's the one that I got wrong. Pigeons on the marquee at Man's Chinese Theater. And this? Mm. An, autograph An autograph in Braille. Now this one. The what theater is see? pretty famous location in Hollywood. Ah, I see. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what that is. Thank you. See, this is this is a problem with fucking like puzzle games sometimes. They rely on, they rely on cultural knowledge that I don't have. <laughs> Um, uh, mm, a cheering crowd. A cheering crowd would be associated with fame, I think. A cheering crowd of lanky albinos. And this one. Uh, I still think this one is right. You know, the flashbulb. You this know, you get American. like Jeez. pictures taken. So because you're famous. Thing that a flashbulb does to your eyes. Well, your choices indicate an obsession with fame. That's one of the indicators of artificial personality disorder. I'd better make a note on your This chart. is like an American-centric puzzle, so it'd be a little you hard for people that don't know locations here. Yeah. <laughs> Am I deranged? I don't want to alarm you, but probably. <laughs> Can I have your hat when they commit you? Sure, little buddy. <laughs> All right, so Let's we have to do the free, free association. association. That will tell us more about your unreasonable reactions to the elements of your life. Remember, I'll All say right. words, and you just do or say whatever comes naturally. Ready? Fire away, Grizzly. Lug nut. What is a lug nut? Someone gave me hints that were American. It was hard for me as an Australian. Yeah, it would make sense for real. Frozen concentrated orange juice. Lamp black. Mm. Lug nuts hold the wheels on your car together. It's the most violent thing you can say. Lamp black. I don't know I what see. any of this is. Fluoride. Fluoride? Hullabaloo. What an unusual response. Teasing. Um, I don't think we're doing this right. Deciduous tree. Mm-hmm. Well, this has been illuminating. Am I sane? The jury's still out. Your reactions didn't tell me anything conclusive. Do you think I might have artificial personality disorder? Maybe, but people with APD are... Okay, so no, that wasn't it. Hmm. Remember, you have to react violently. Let's try some more free association. But we have to that react violently to dentistry. Reactions to the elements of your life. Remember, I'll say words, and you just do or say whatever comes naturally. Use your gun. Ready? Ready as oh, okay. a rooster taking a bath in barbecue sauce. Interesting choice of words. All right, li literally Max speech. fucking backseating <laughs> the video game. That's not a word, is it? <laughs> Wait, fuck, I didn't listen to the word. God damn it, I was too focused. I was too focused on the joke. Be careful where you wave that thing in my office. 
Oh, I'm always careful. Hmm. Violent reaction to the word. Very interesting. Polish. Hmm. Polish? Can I sit in the tattoo chair while we do this? Me first! Trigger word induces unusual desire for tattoo in subject. Possible symptom of euphoric dyspepsia. Shampoo. Just do or say whatever comes naturally. Shampoo? And that really doesn't have anything to do with dentistry. I don't get it. Do you think this would work better if I lie down? Subject wishes to assume supine position. Trigger word apparently inducing sleepiness. Well, <laughs> have this you has ever been, been to a movie. dentist? Uh, Actually, not in a couple of years. The jury's still out. Your reactions didn't tell me anything conclusive. Do you think I might have artificial personality disorder? Maybe. But yeah, we messed up. I, I don't get let's it. Try some more free association. That will tell us more about your unreasonable reactions to the elements of your life. I'm trying to like Remember, fucking words, like. And you just do or say whatever. Like, comes what did natural. Polish have to Here's do with gun. dentistry? Ready? Yep. Credo. Credo. Tooth polish. You can get tooth polished? What? Well, that's new to me. Uh, what the fuck is a Credo? I don't know. Forceps. Really? Interesting. Filling. No, I never had my teeth <laughs> Filling. Uh, okay, filling, I do know that that is like dentistry Can't related. You wave that thing in my office. Oh, I'm always careful. Hmm. Violent I've had I've had a, a filling. Very yes, that 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 one I do know. Tint. Just do or say whatever Tint? comes naturally. Is that dentistry related? Tint. Uh. Cook. That's literally what toothpaste does. What? No, it doesn't. You don't polish your fucking teeth with toothpaste. Like you would need a fucking grinder to polish shit. Uh, tint is just colors, though. I guess not. Can I sit in the tattoo chair while we do this? Me first! Trigger word induces unusual desire for tattoo in subject. Possible symptom of euphoric dyspepsia. Well, this has been illuminating. Yes? Your responses lead me to believe that you have an unusual right, reaction <laughs> to dentistry. You should see him at the podiatrist's. It could be symptomatic of artificial personality disorder. I'd better mark this on your chart. Wow! It <laughs> Let's grind to a polish? More like disorder. floor you polish? All the signs. Huh. I bet I can get a paper out of this. Best ship me off to some sort of home for former child stars then. I've signed this admissions form, but you'll have to arrange your own transportation. I'm about to be really busy publishing the details of your case. <laughs> Since you're crazy, can I drive? Jumping vehicular homicide, no. Coco confirmed smart, yes, I am smart. You're right. You're so right. Finally you did it, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for my n lack of knowledge of dentistry, apparently. <laughs> Where are we going, Sam? Back to Brady Culture's home for former child stars. Oh, okay. I don't have money to go to the dentist. I haven't gone in, like, years. Coco confirmed smarter than the average bimbo. I only went last time because I needed a filling. Specifically, and that's why I know <laughs> the word. All it took was us confirming Coco has no idea what toothpaste does. It's like soap for your teeth. It's like it's like washing them. It doesn't polish them. What do you mean it polishes your teeth? What the fuck? This thing gave me the willies. <laughs> no, no worries, Debbie. <laughs> Coco has she has to brush her teeth. Coco has no teeth. 
I don't have healthy teeth. That is true. Oh my god. Well, that was spooky. What did it say? Beware of heavily medicated what? <laughs> oh, we didn't check the box. I think someone was sitting here. Coco, and you leaking! Polish can mean to clean right. No, I did not know that. I the the definition that I knew for polish was to like essentially sand smooth. Like you're sanding something to be smooth. You're getting rid of like those like little bumps, little imperfections and polish to a shine, you know? Come on, little buddy, there's justice to be served. Can we get ice cream Always afterwards? Justice makes me hungry. Have fat ass, have plush lips. <laughs> oh, man. The fucking frame drops, holy shit. How is this game so fucking this poorly me optimized? This place where Aunt Trudy lives with the medicine smell and the rubber sheets and the enormous mute Indian. Sounds like a million laughs. Yeah, mostly after medication time. Where is everybody? I think this is an enhanced version of the game. What collection is this from? Yeah, this is the enhanced version they released Welcome like a couple of years ago, I think, on Steam. This is Culture's Clubhouse. Jumping Lon Chaney in a boffo fright wig. Brady Culture, I presume. You know who I am? Wow! Evil plans really do work. <laughs> Don't get too excited, Stretch Pants. The freelance police are here. Yes, actually. I've been waiting for you. Really? Next time, try leaving the front door open. Save us all some grief. Allow me to explain. <laughs> uh -oh. Yeah, that's a good point. You know, if, if, if he wanted the us to get here, of a pint of yak butter, why not just leave I the door never open? Wanted much. Just to be universally loved, that's all. <laughs> and to be number one in the TV ratings that's for the 1971 all. fall season. But no. Those worthless hacks, the soda puppies, with their matching shirts and their cute little jingles. They came on opposite <laughs> me and stole my audience. Oh my god. I was never offered another role. And now you can be the land. Don't even let a poor down on his Absolutely luck actor. Real. Mass hypnotize the entire viewing public to become his worshipful fans forever. How cruel. Is it over? I think so. <laughs> so? Whoops. Since you've ruined the beautiful irony of having my arch rivals run my promotional campaign, I'm afraid you'll Ask just have to take their places. In your dreams, <laughs> culture! No, my friends. In yours. Oh, no! Hey, that tickles! Become Video Delivery Man. Max is immune to getting him the oh, on an entire streaming audience. <laughs> what? What's happening? Oh no. Oh no! What are you doing? I, I don't know. I You were in on it all along! I told you it was a conspiracy! I told you! But then you already knew, didn't you? <laughs> no, Bosco, I must deliver videos. Call the CIA! Call Interpol! Call Mickey Rooney! Must deliver Mickey Rooney videos. <laughs> Oh my god. I can't control myself. I can't do anything. Hey, my beloved weapons are gone. <gasps> no. And I punch I myself. Must deliver videos. Hmm. Can I punch myself? I must deliver videos. No. I must deliver videos. Oh, don't even try. Oh, perfect. I love that part. <laughs> Do something illegal. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh-oh. Either I just walked into the Salvador Dali Memorial Wax Museum, or I'm dreaming. You love me, 
You adore me. <laughs> fucking cheese stuff. Video delivery man. Do my evil bidding and so forth. <laughs> Holy brains in a blender. I'm still hypnotized. If only I could remember what Sybil told me to do. Destroy <laughs> the intruder in your dream. Oh, yeah. Hey, Sam, I'm up here. Oh, hi, little buddy. Brady stole my body. I hate when people do that. You gotta get me down from here. Okay, little guy, I'll save you. <laughs> All right. Different. Didn't hurt. <laughs> hmm. That's it. <laughs> Can I shoot the light bulb? <laughs> you can't shoot me. I'm incandescent. That Zaza got me speaking Esperanto. It's just a dream, Sam. The edible Ashii. <laughs> I will be number one in the ratings now and thanks to cable for all eternity weird hmm. I will be universally loved by everyone in the universe all right now that's not it ah Strange. Enigmatic. Uh. It's Brady Culture on TV. Yes, right where I belong. Everyone watch me. Me! <laughs> I mean, I'm getting the feeling that everything is just bulletproof, so I don't, I don't see what's going to happen if I shoot the TV, but... <laughs> Shooting TV stars only makes them stronger. Yeah, that's, that's not it. Smoke? Queer. Why are we calling the smoke queer? Odd. Interesting. Wait, what? A bicycle? What is this thing? Oh! Sweet rodent eating disorders. That is one fat rat. Okay. Brady culture. Hey, Brady Cheese. What is it, fool? I'd like to introduce you to a little friend of mine. It's me. <laughs> it's the big rat. No, the cheese must stand alone. No! The big rat. And another one bites the cheese. Perfect. Uh-uh. You want to name every single one oh, of your children after me. <laughs> I cannot believe that inflation was actually it's the solution. Dream, Sam. Uh, so there's Jesse James' hand. Dance, puppet, dance. Some smoke. I don't think the bicycle bump is gonna do anything I think I've now, done but enough pumping for one dream. All right, yeah. Inflation followed by bore. Actually, one way sign. What is this doing here? Hey, it's loose. Ooh. Whoa. Whee! <laughs> that was the most fun I've had since I lost my body. Let's do it again, Sam. Hmm. What now? Yay! <laughs> That was great! But Sam, if you'll notice, I'm right back where I started! Okay, hold on, I'll think of something. Coco Brain is in left booba and is Brady's a stolen in the Max's right. body. Oh, and it feels good too. I just love my new furry paws and cute little tail. Hey, don't <laughs> touch my tail, you psychopathic body stealer! Ooh, just let me at him! Uh How do I get him to move then? I love my hair, and you do too. Brady's stolen Max's body. <laughs> Just let me at him. Mm. Uh, 
Nope. I will have legions of sick. God damn it! What do I do? I am Brady Culture, and you are not. Get used to it. I mean, let's see what's... We haven't even checked what's in the closet now. Nothing? Okay, that's good. That's enough pumps for one dream, Sam. What does that mean, Sam? Stop, Sam. Yeah, you're right. They give you the gun on the dream, so you, you should be able to use it. But, like, fucking how? It's just... Brady. Smoke. Brady. Closet. Wait. What if I don't shoot the fucking... No, that just pulls away the gun. Okay, never mind. Why, yes, this is my real hair. Whoa! Whee! <laughs> Right back where I started. Okay, hold on. I'll get you. All right, so I'm able to shoot the one-way sign. So that must mean that I should be activating it from afar. I'm guessing. Weird. What do I do with the fucking hand? Nothing. <laughs> Shooting TV stars only makes them stronger. Maybe if I'm right. Oh, maybe I need. You're right. Maybe I just need to catch Max's head. Stay under the lamp head and shoot the sign. Whee! Shoot Whoa. God. Gotcha. There we go. Yay! All right, so now I have Max. Oh, Mr. Culture, I have a surprise for you. Really? For me? No! <laughs> oh my. What the fuck? <laughs> oh no, that was great. <laughs> Thanks, Sam. A little stringy, but good. Oh, I just remembered, I'm supposed to be somewhere. Bye, Max. Max is fucking adorable, I love him. All right, that's two out of four. What else now? Brady there, there must culture. be something we need to do with the smoke. Nice name for a country, don't you think? Strange. We didn't get anything else. Brady culture able to grab is the man of your dream. Wait, what are you calling? Sam not and Max, much, a.k.a. the writers, barely disguised Now go wash my car. <laughs> the writers barely disguised fetish. What happens when you have bad TV reception? Oh, I wonder I what would I happen have... to the picture quality if I gave this a tug. No! I must be on TV for all eternity! I didn't even notice that there was a no! coat hanger on the TV. Oh yes, that's much better reception. Oh, you're right, the, the light switch. someone needs to turn the lights out on your career, Brady. Oh my god. What? Uh, no! I, I was trying to think about this oh, so Brady fucking culture. hard. <laughs> he turns the world off with his smile. It was so simple. It was so fucking oh, simple. Uh. Oh no! He's awake! We're done for! Save the girlish histrionics, Bosco. I'm alright. Hmm. I was merely the victim of your garden variety video delivery hypnosis scheme. Okay, but what about your co-conspirator? My co-conspirator? Holy underpants draped to the mast of a sinking pork rind freighter! That hirsute egomaniac kidnapped my little buddy! Any idea how I can curtail this culture crisis? Brady culture. I bow man. Huh, stay away from him. He's got it in for me. Sorry, Bosco, <laughs> no can do. I've got to save my furry little pal. I don't suppose you have a Bosco Tech device that stymies hypnosis-inducing energy beams. Oh, a, a hypnosis blocker? 
Yeah, I thought about making one of those, but I wouldn't even know where to begin. I've got to find something quick. <laughs> Thanks, Bosco. Do me proud. Hmm. What could I get to not get hypnotized? There's no time for that. I've got to rescue Max. That won't help me rescue Max. You know who would have loved that? Max. <laughs> That's exactly the sort of thing Max would have looked at. <laughs> that makes me miss Max for some unknown reason. Oh, I love this. Max, is that you? No, I'm starting to hallucinate. Max, are you in there? Oh. There's no time for that. I've got to rescue Max. We need a tin foil hat, you're right. We need to get tin foil. Just... <laughs> Alright, let's go ask Sybil. Sam is missing his husband. Two lovers. Forced apart by destiny. That is so sad. I feel like I'm close to the ending of the game, so I really kind of... Well, not the game, of the episode at the very least, though. So. Doc, Max is gone. Well, most of us outgrow our imaginary <laughs> friends eventually. <laughs> no, that megalomaniac Brady Culture's got him. I see. Of course. <laughs> fucking imaginary. <laughs> Hang on. Secret Were you tunnel. implying that Max Secret is imaginary? Tunnel. I wasn't implying anything, though he does seem a little <laughs> improbable. You see him too, though, right? True, but then I'm a psychotherapist. <laughs> I've got to find some way to block a hypnotic ray. Oh, I, love it. I don't suppose you, as a brain specialist of sorts, would know anything. Uh... <laughs> Great suffering lab rats, you do know something. Out with it, before my synapses fuse into a milky puddle of slag. Well, <laughs> gross breach of doctor-patient privilege for me to even tell you about it. But one of my more technologically inclined patients drew me a diagram of a contraption he claimed will block hypnosis. That's just the sort of ridiculously lucky break I need. <laughs> it's a huge violation of every reasonable code of ethical conduct, of course. But you being a policeman of sorts, I suppose it's okay to give you the diagram. <laughs> My lack of solid engineering background has finally caught up with me. I can't make any sense of this. I'd love to help, but engineering is one of the few fields I haven't tried. Sorry. All right, all right. So definitely bring this to Bosco, right? Just like Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> this is just like Kingdom Hearts. You're right. Exactly like Kingdom Hearts. Hey, Bosco. You okay? Yep. Oh, I needed Bosco. to use the item, right? Be proud. Bosco, take a gander at this. What is it? A death threat? Even better. It's instructions for the latest in Bosco tech innovation. Hmm. Well, let's see. A colander of that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I can build this. Just need one thing. What's that? Something for that antenna thing at the top. Antenna. Got it. Antenna. Let's get the coat hanger. That has to be it. Right? Or is it gonna be the fucking that parking meter? Me rescue Max. Okay, it's not the parking meter. It's got to be the 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 fucking coat hanger, right? Max isn't gonna like it when he finds out I ruined our reception. I've got to tell him as soon as possible. <laughs> Let's go. Finally, the puzzles make sense. You can't shoot me, I'm being contested. I am so smart. You're right. I am so very smart. Will a make-do antenna do as a make-do antenna? Yeah, okay. 
Let me just add a little Bosco Tech innovation. <laughs> and here it is. The most sophisticated hypnosis blocking helmet the world has ever seen. Happy days are here again. Uh oh, it seems like the old Moolah gauge is running smart. on empty. Ah, take it. Just stop that Brady culture. He's got it in for me. <laughs> You're a credit to dementia, Bosco. You'll have to pay for the next one, though. Bimbo lady. <laughs> my favorite smarty bimbo lady. Thank you. <laughs> and thank you for the pets. I am very smart indeed. Alright, so. Let's grab the car. I'm coming, Max. Yeah, let's go. Let's save the Bunui. Uh, I'll put it on inside Brady Culture's home. I wouldn't want to be caught wearing last year's fashions in this neighborhood. <laughs> okay. All right, fine. Uh, I'll put oh, it on. God damn it. Just go through the gate. Rule number three. Always wear protective headgear when confronting diabolical villains with hypnotic devices. All right, there it is. <laughs> oh my god, the frame drops again. Culture. Sam! Boy, am I glad to see you. Johann Sebastian here only knows how to play one song. What's this, a rerun? Didn't we just see the dog getting hypnotized episode? <laughs> well, if you really want to watch it again... <laughs> what? Another triumph for skanky ingenuity and ordinary kitchenware. Give it up, culture. Your quiche is cooked. Time out for the cavalry! You've colored outside the lines of the law, Brady Culture. Wait, Great mind. Thank you for the thank you for the sub. To get Appreciate it. Again. <laughs> oh no. I'm sure you all remember the commands I taught you. So now, my foolish pawns, attack the dog! <laughs> What the fuck? That doesn't need another code. Oh. Caffeine rush! Okay. Become Brady Culture. <laughs> Do my evil bidding. Worship the videotapes! What nonsense! Attack the dog! Ouch! <laughs> Alright. That's that's a bit of fucking weird logic, like Rush! Like get them to run away and then you can give them a command? Like what? Attack Brady Culture! No! Attack the dog! Ow! Caffeine! Hmm. Alright, alright. Become Sam? Okay, that makes sense. Become me! Somersaulting Democrats in a crate of sauerkraut! Patience is a sharp <laughs> razor to swallow! You crack me up, little buddy. Who's that supposed to be? Stop this <laughs> foolishness! Attack the oh, dog! So adorable. <laughs> hmm. Caffeine rush! rush! All right, all right. We we probably have to go with the worship one. Attack the dog! Wait, what? Ow. Oh, that was weird. Caffeine rush! rush! Worship yourselves! Worship yourselves! Boneheads! Attack the dog! Ow. Okay, we're just in a fucking loop right now. So... Huh. It's a stack of those Ibo videos. Okay. Every bed's got its own TV. Creepy. I feel like making a bad pun about Brady's organ, but I'm a little busy right now. <laughs> uh, you okay, little buddy? Oh, sure. I've been amusing our adversary with gory haiku poems while he plays that dumb song over and over. 
Hey, that's my theme song. Maybe getting them to attack you will get Braided Sage to attack himself. Yeah. It's gonna be literally, literally fucking duck season, bunny season. Are we going by that? Attack me. Whoops. Ah. Nope. <laughs> Do I do I have to get them to like watch the videos again or something maybe? Worship the videotapes. Imbeciles! Attack the dog! Ow! No, nope. I'm not getting it. You may as well give up now, culture. Your hypnotic ray thing and Madoodle won't work on me anymore. True. But I have my adoring minions. Yeah, they don't really like you, though. Shut up! They do so! I force them to. Hmm. Okay. Caffeine Rush! Rush! I don't think that would be interested in ocular fitness. Hmm. Worship Brady culture. Ah, uh -huh. uh, okay. We gotta play to his ego, of course. Attack the dog! No. Ow. God damn it. Okay, we're making progress. Caffeine rush! We're making some progress here. Worship Brady culture. Uh -huh. Alright, so now what? Every bed's got its own TV. Creepy. Uh -huh. I feel like making a bad pun about Brady's organ, but I'm a little busy right now. Nice hat, by the way. It protects me from that ray of his. Speaking of which, I don't see you delivering videotapes. Yeah, apparently I can't be hypnotized. It was driving the Phantom here berserk. <laughs> There's got to be something wrong with his brain. Well, that goes without saying. <laughs> hmm. You should surrender. I've got the place surrounded. Liar, liar, pants on fire! Uh... Every bed's got its own TV. Creepy. Wait, do I have to put the fucking videotape? I don't think that would be interested nope. in ocular fitness. Have you tried asking them to worship you? I think I have, but not after this, so maybe... Worship me! No, me, me, worship me! Oh, you're, you're right. My minions, my! I think we tried it, but it was before we got him to... We got them to worship him. Worship me! No! Me! Me! Worship me! Everything is about me! Uh. Probably close me, to me, figuring me. it out, but... I'd rather punch other things. No? That won't help me rescue Max. I can't punch Max? I'll have this wrapped up in a minute, little buddy. That's good. I'd hate to miss my favorite mind-numbing formulaic evening TV program. <laughs> uh... Me, me, me! Do we just keep making them, like... Worship me! No! Me, me! Worship me! Everything is about me! I think, I think we went, like, we went through that exact one already, so probably not. It's not too late to give up and come along peacefully. I'm rubber, you're glue. Bounce off me and stick to you. <laughs> hmm. Can I suggest? Worship Brady culture. Ha <laughs> ha! I know. Attack me. Attack me. 
Whoops. Ow. Mm. No, that kind of just got us back to the beginning. Ouch. Worship fever. Caffeine rush! My god, this is exactly why I don't play point and click adventure games. <laughs> this is exactly why I don't. The fucking moon logic. Worship me. me when he's in a hissy fit. No, me, me. Worship me. Everything is but like about we can't me. do anything during these cutscenes. Can I? Attack no. The dog. Ow. <laughs> me, me, me. Listen to Worship me. Oh, we don't have to even like. Get no, them to do me, the caffeine me. rush. Never mind. Worship me. Everything is about me. Worship me. Worship me again. Worship me. Then attack me. No, me, me. Worship me. Everything is about me. Attack me. No, me! Attack me! We tried me, this me, before! Me. Yes! What the fuck? No, wait, I mean... Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Smart hey, move, hey. Sam! Ooh. You played him Ooh. like a two-dollar glockenspiel! We had to try that before! First grade. I tried to send you semaphore signals with my ears, but you know how oh, I always we broke the, the chain? Oh, mixed up. God you cracked me up, little buddy. Well, I guess we should dehypnotize these poor saps again and be on our way. <laughs> Let me! You know how I adore gratuitous violence! God damn it, I hate this. I hate the fucking, like, puzzle- the fucking, like, logic puzzles. Well, that's that, Max. Another boot to the pasty ass of crime. Thank goodness this whole hypnotic mind control <laughs> thing didn't go any further. That could have been really annoying. <laughs> Uh, it's great to be on your show, Myra. I'm a huge fan. I just can't seem to stop watching for some reason. What? What was that about? <laughs> All right, that was pretty funny, to be honest, though. <laughs> oh my! Yeah, a bit, a bit anticlimactic with the not being able to figure out what to do, but other than that, some people go into these games intentionally getting the wrong answer so they can hear all the dialogue. Did it. Oh, I see. We did it! We did it! Yay! Coco confirmed, smarty pants. I am smart. I am very smart. It takes a while. That took a while. That was just episode one, and that took like two and a half hours. <laughs> really makes a bimbo shirt more accurate, girl. Basic logic puzzles of bimbo's biggest weakness. It is. It is. It's not fair. It's not not fair. It's not fair that I need to fucking think. I don't like it. Coco gets a gold star for being so smart. I am very smart. I am very smart. You're right. <laughs> In memory of Caring Nelson. Oh, rip. Well, that was a fun time. That was a fun, fun, that was a fun episode, for real. But I'm gonna call it for the night. <sighs> she gets a gold star and a golden bed in Instagram. could figure out a bimbo's biggest weakness. <laughs> it was fun, I did enjoy it. It was a bit obtuse at times, but for the most part, it was fun. It was fun, so... I probably, night, I do want to check night, out the everyone. other ones. <laughs> So like we'll we'll keep on we'll keep on with the Sam and Max probably until like maybe I get bored of it or something. <laughs> Cause like given given that there's plenty episodes of like fucking six episodes, I don't know if I want to dedicate like six streams to this. I don't know. 
but at the very least we can like do at least one more next time so we'll see but anyways thank you for joining the stream hope you all had fun hope you'll enjoy yourselves thank you thank you very much for joining me love you all i'll be seeing you again soon mwah, mwah, mwah. <laughs> see you around have a good night everyone bye bye